It's recording, right? Okay. Put it back down. No, no, no. It just. Adam, listen to this song video. There we go. What? Yeah, that's the Oh, I get it. I get it. Okay, so it's like. Yeah, okay. So you got to you had to put it down. Yeah, okay. So the highest point is like. Yeah. Go. So she pulls back off. Yeah, can you pull back on the But it's not about the same. No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. So what do you? Why is that though? Because I think the rubber bands. I think they got this is too, this is too low. They got stretched over. No, but I can tighten if you want. I just switched no, ours. Like, would you use these rubber bands? Come to I think it's yeah. too low. It's ours is way up here. There's no, but I'm I'm hooking this up to yeah. the rubber bands. And these these are stretched rubber bands. I just I just have these ones. Yeah, we have we have tiny ones. No, because I have to be tightened every time. Okay, yeah. Okay. Okay, you ready? Is everybody ready? Yeah. Ready? Everybody's ready? Okay. Yeah, Ruby and one. Ruby and one. Yeah, I know. Should we replace some bands? Yeah, like four times. You might even want to take the red and the blue off. You are the red and the blue, and there's the white. But the thing is, you have a bigger. Yeah, it's okay, let's try again. Yeah. Wait. Just take one of the rubber bands off. What happened to David? Because okay, you have two rubber bands, right? What happened to the guy? Okay, okay no, just try it. Sure. And then I'll take it off. Yeah, I need two rubber bands per side. Yeah. So we only have one okay. per side and then one in the middle. Go. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, higher. that's better. Yeah. yeah, see the green is much more higher. It's still not as high as theirs, but it's still higher. Yeah. But yeah. the thing is, like, you do have a bigger thing that you smash it with. So I've seen yeah. you guys smash it, it's fine. Yeah. So you're just. I'll probably have a place for Okay, let's do. Ours isn't as much as Patty's. Uh, actually. Yeah, they're yeah, they're but you don't want too much. Let's try again. Ready? Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Let me delete that one. Uh, hold on, Patty. Hold on, Patty. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Look at that smell. Is it the purple? Yeah, it's common. Yeah. What is this? I think ours is the most important because, yeah, we have a little smaller. Well, this is getting like close. Ah! See, theirs has the least because their rubber band is the farthest away. Yeah, and yours is the closest. Ours is like in the middle, so that would make more sense. Forces dependent on how close you are the are you? Because the closer they are, the more they have to stretch. Is it a force? Yes. I guess. I mean, you don't want to make a lot of middle power. Yeah. Because you want the big pieces of the power. I naturally do. Okay. One second, I'm renaming all these. Green, Katie, and Gabby. Yeah. Where is Gabby? I don't know. Where's Ben? Alright. Red and pink are Katie and Gabby. You guys are KG, okay? Not yet.
yet. Don't know 16. yet. Thank you. I get three. Mm -hmm. We already had three thousand. Oh. These represent. <laughs> okay. These the 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 pink, the red and the green. Yes, the red and the green are who's uh, Katie's and Gabby's. Katie's and Gabby's. They're force lines. Those are those are their machines. Mm -hmm. Yes, and so the pink. So what are what are the force lines? Why are they going up and down like that? Well. Pink. I know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, yes, I have. This not. is when, if this was the thing, this is when they were going like this. But when it sort of got back here, it started just going down because of gravity at this part. And then when they were putting it back, they were just putting it back slowly, so there was force pulling it back down. So that was this hump right here. And then when it got to the bottom, that was about right here. Okay. So it got to the bottom of what? Uh, when it got to the bottom of the machine, like okay, so we, it, we pull it back, and then, yeah. so the first part was when you pull it, this little valve was sort of like this, okay. this is when it was just going down and it was pulling, but it was just going slowly. Alright, so, right, so let's take one out, we really see well, let's take this top one. They, they started pulling on the, the arm of the nutcracker, and just started putting a little force on it to get it over, right? And then the, so the force curve starts going like this because they're putting more and more force on it as they pull it up. And when they get to the max amount of force, they were up here. And then they lowered the arm back down and reduced the force they're putting on it, so it went back down. And this is back down to zero and let go of the thing here. So this is just their first curve. What does this represent on the top then would you say that? Times the amount of force. Times the amount of force they took to move that arm, right? So if you were to hold this arm up, just hold it against the rubber bands, what would happen to the graph? It would probably stay up there. It would stay up there, wouldn't it? It was just kind of flatten out at whatever force you were applying. You kept pushing, pulling against the rubber bands. The rubber bands are pulling on you. You're pulling the rubber bands, and the machine is measuring how much you're pulling on the rubber bands. Which yeah, is the same the force that they're pulling on you. The, the pink is before Katie and Gabby tighten their rubber bands, and then they tighten it. Got the red, tightened it more, got the green, and then they added a second rubber band and got this weird maroon color. And, and then, then they're going to be snapped. And went back to their normal one rubber band. Okay, we're about out of time for today, unfortunately, but we'll pick this up again tomorrow. And what I want you guys to start thinking about is how you can use all this data. And this is what scientists do they measure, measure things and they say, What does this tell us? What good is this? We can use this now to make for something. And they did it one time. They said, well, let's see what we do. What happens if we put another rubber band on? Get higher force, of course. And one question might be, how much more force do you get per rubber band? How I many rubber bands would be the maximum or the optimum, as we call it? So there's lots and lots of ways we'll analyze this. We'll talk about some more tomorrow. Congratulations, you guys took a new technology you've never seen before. And in five minutes, you made it work. So you had a great job. Let's do the best we can to pick up and get before we go on the bells and ring. We'll follow us home today. <laughs> 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 <laughs>